Hey y'all, good morning. <laughs> I was trying to look for my tripod and sit this on, but because my arms, y'all, I always look like I'm like this. Like, come on, get it together. Anyway, <laughs> good morning, y'all. Um, I don't know if y'all can tell, but I am so tired. Uh, um, this is the next day from the clip you saw before. I'm so tired. I'm sitting in my office and I'm on a computer. You can see. Dama and Chrissy, shout out to them. And little baby Dominic, love you guys. Anyway, um, <laughs> so I was watching some YouTube videos and I have a thousand tabs up because I'm doing a thousand things at once. I'm also making a list for the store, for the party, um, Saturday. I'm just doing a thousand things at once and I'm just exhausted. Like, I'm hungry. It's 11.03 right now. I've been up since 7 and I haven't eaten anything. I had some frappuccino, which is my favorite. I didn't think I was going to drink all of it, but I don't know. I guess I was thirsty. But anyway, I'm hungry. The only thing I really want to do is get something to eat and take a nap, to be honest with y'all. Like, I'm exhausted. Last, like, this is probably the third day where... I've just been really tired like all day the last two days I've just been really tired um and I just want to sit down or lay down or take a nap and then when I sit down for a while I'm like look I'm tired of sitting down I'm ready to do something <laughs> I did the same thing yesterday and I ended up going to Walmart and where else did I go Walgreens to pick up a few things or whatever and I came back home and I felt like I ran a freaking marathon y'all like I was like oh my god but um yeah i'm just exhausted i have so much to do um i really need to do my daily cleaning up of the house but <laughs> the more i think about it the more i'm like uh i just don't want to and something happened to my camera just now i don't know what that was about but anyway um yeah i just don't want to like <laughs> i definitely have to my goal today was to clean the kitchen Spruce up the living room a little bit from yesterday because it's literally like I still have to vacuum. I didn't vacuum yesterday so I have to vacuum and pick up a few things and that's it in the living room. I have to clean the entire kitchen and I want to clean out our coat closet um, by our front door because my daughters have basically torn everything apart in there. It's coats and shoes and blankets and everything is just everywhere. Nothing is on hangers. It's just, <laughs> it's just in there. Okay, like you can barely close the door. So, I want to clean that out, hang everything up, put it back where it's supposed to be, clean the kitchen, and spruce up the living room a little bit. Oh, and I also wanted to clean the bathroom. That's one of my daily routines. Like, I have to clean. Um, if I don't clean anything else in the house, I like to keep at least the bathroom and the downstairs clean. My room and the girls' room can wait because it's not like people are going to come over and go straight in our room. So, But, um, yeah, the girls are going to clean their room when they get home. In my room, I'm not worried about because it's not that bad. I just have um, a lot of laundry still to do. I really just want to take it all to the laundromat versus using my washer and dryer because it just seems like if I use my washer and dryer because I cleaned out other closets, I have a lot of stuff that I need to wash, um, um, including blankets and sheets and stuff. So I'm like, if I use our washer and dryer, which is fine, I'm at home and it's excellent. And it's great and it's convenient because I'm at home. It's just going to take forever. Literally, it's going to take forever. I just want to go to the laundromat, have everything in the wash at one time, have everything in the dryer at one time, and bring home everything at one time. And then I can take my time folding it up or hanging it or whatever. That's what I want to do. But um, with me being by myself for the rest of the week, basically with my husband at work and the girls at school, Literally, that's going to be it. Like, I can't. I will not be able to clean the house like I plan to do today and go to the laundromat. It's not going to happen. So, <laughs> um, so I, I don't know what I'm going to do yet. But uh, I'm sitting here, like I said, doing a thousand things at once. Thinking of a million things at once to do. Um, and try to just plan it all out. Because I'm, I'm the type of person that needs to plan things. And if I don't plan things... I will either forget something or I will just take a nap, like I said, <laughs> because I'm so tired, y'all. Um, but yeah, um, I just wanted to give y'all a little heads up on what's going on today. Um, I guess you'll see me a little later, y'all. Um, I'm thinking about even doing something to this head. We will see. 
Uh, and I was even thinking about throwing on some makeup. We will also see because <laughs> I have like two videos to film that I have not filmed yet. And I keep saying for the last, like I say, a few days, I need to do these videos. But I don't want to look like a bum. <laughs> okay. But at the same time, like I said, I'm just exhausted. And I just, I'm just exhausted, y'all. I have a terrible headache since I woke up. It's literally wrapped around my whole head. It's really bad in the back of my head. I just have so many things going on. Like, I just feel like I don't have time right now for me. Which is terrible to say. But it's true. Um, so I really don't want, I need my eyebrows done. As y'all can probably see. I don't really want to do them myself. Because the um, eyebrow razor that I have isn't that good. Um... So I don't want to do my makeup with my eyebrows looking a hot mess. And I don't want to do my makeup and get my eyebrows done with my hair looking a mess. You know what I'm saying? And I don't want to do my hair and then my eyebrows and face look a mess because I didn't put makeup on. So it's just like I'm just a mess. Okay, you guys. I am a mess. So what I'm thinking is maybe later on today, maybe going to get some type of wig or something that way I can cornrow my hair and I won't have to necessarily do it per se throw on a wig get my eyebrows done real quick throw on makeup and you know at least look decent so that not only I can film but I can just feel decent because right now I feel like I look okay <laughs> but we will see I, and I and like I said on the other hand I'm so 50 50 with everything on the other hand I kind of want to do my hair so that that's one less thing to think about on a daily basis you know what i'm saying that's one less thing to think about for this weekend that's one less thing to think about for at least another a month or so you know so i don't know we will see but whatever i do for the rest of the day of course i'm going to bring y'all you guys along i hope you guys are doing way better than i am today <laughs> Other than that whole spill, I'm actually feeling as health wise and with this pregnancy, I'm actually feeling okay today. When I woke up, I was um, a bit nauseous, just out of the blue. But um, I think because I needed something in my system, once I had that coffee a little bit, it kind of, I guess, put something in my stomach. So I'm not nauseous anymore, but I am getting hungry, like I said. But other than that, I feel okay today so far. So um like i said um anything else coming up i'm gonna bring you you guys along if i go to the store or not or you know whatever i do so i'm going to continue this and figure out what my plan is and i'll see y'all guys later Bye. hey y'all it is the next day <laughs> i know i keep um switching from days to days from days to days what from day to day i'm sorry lighting is crazy i'm trying to stand in front of the window but anyway so I didn't vlog much yesterday because my cousin actually had to go to the emergency room. He was having chest pains and something else. He was feeling lightheaded or something at the bus stop. So he went to the ER. Um, so I really didn't vlog that. And I was, <coughs> excuse me, just really busy doing everything that I said I was going to do in the last vlog, which I actually didn't even finish. Um, and then my cousins came over and blah, blah, blah. Um... My dad actually just left. He came to drop off a few things for me. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. My gosh. I need to go to Walmart to pick up um, to pick up a pump, like an air mattress pump for my aunt. Um, I have to pick her up that. And then we'll pick that up for her. My hair looks a mess. I'm not dressed. I just you guys like lately i'm really nauseous right now um and what's making me hesitate is that right now it's almost 12 or it is 12 okay so it's almost 12 30 <laughs> and i need she lives about 30 minutes from me where i am right now which i can make it there in 20 with my driving <laughs> but um the Walmart is just like kind of out of the way a little bit. And then it's a Walmart closer to me. But I really don't like going there. I may just go there anyway. Um, because I can't get in touch with her. Usually we FaceTime almost every morning, every day. And I haven't been able to get in touch with her. Her phone's been acting up lately too. Um, so I don't want to go down to um, the Walmart that's out of the way. But I think I'm going to have to do that regardless because 
what I want is this what I want to eat. I haven't eaten yet today, y'all. And I know that's bad. I'm pregnant. And I know it's terrible. But I'm not a morning person. And I'm definitely not a breakfast person. So I don't really eat early. I, if I, you see me eating early, it's because I'm really hungry. And that's only because I'm pregnant. But uh, um, this morning when I got the girls up and on the bus, I actually laid back down for a little bit. Which was good because I got some more rest. But it was that type of rest, y'all, where... You ever took a nap or went back to sleep or went to sleep period or whatever and woke up and it felt like you wasn't even asleep like the entire time? That's how I felt. So I know because of that I'm going to be tired later um, even though I did get some sleep. But as of right now, I'm okay. I'm just nauseous. So that's the story I was saying. Um, <laughs> all these side notes. Um, so, excuse me. I went to this place called Jimmy John's. It's like a sandwich shop in my area but the only one is by the other walmart that's out of the way from where i want to go so i figured since i'm going to jimmy john's i might as well go to that walmart right there because it's literally in the same shopping center and get the pump and then go to my aunt's house drop the pump off and then i'll be able to make it back here before the girls get off of the bus um or i could pick them up from school or something like that but, once again, I can't get in touch with her. So, it's like I'm putting everything on hold until I figure out where she is. And I'm putting everything on hold because, to be honest with you, I can just go get the pump and, you know, get my sandwich and come home and give it to her later. Um, but, the reason I'm putting everything on hold is because um, she may be in my area. She may, she may come down to my area to my cousin's house because he was in the hospital yesterday to come visit him. She told me that yesterday, but she said maybe, and she also didn't tell me around what time, and she doesn't drive. She's on the bus, so I'm like, you know, I don't know where she is, and I don't want to start heading out. I don't want to have to go out to come back in, to go back out again. You know what I'm saying? Because I have other things I need to do within the house. So, I'm waiting on that, and I'm not going to wait. Ooh, sorry, you guys. It's dark in my house. Um, I'm not going to wait too long because... Like I said, I have other things to do. I'm not going to just be sitting around the house waiting on her to pick up a pump. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, um, yesterday I did the whole, I cleaned the whole downstairs. Um, I was contracting a lot. So, um, I got my goals done. I did what I wanted to do yesterday. Um, the only thing I did not do was like detailed cleaning of my bathroom. I cleaned it, but I didn't do like the detailed cleaning, which I like to do, um, which I wanted to do yesterday, but it's okay. Because the bathroom is the smallest room in the house and it will get done. Um, so today my plan is to, I'm sorry about the lighting you guys. It is terrible. But, you know, whatever. Um, so today, <clears throat> excuse me, my plan is to get the whole upstairs done. So like, um, my, I'm going to do somewhat detailed cleaning on my room. Like, I'm not going to be scrubbing baseboards or anything. But like getting behind the dresser and, you know, things like that. <clears throat> I have excuse my language I have a shit ton of laundry to do I was talking to my husband last night when he got home from work and I was just like you know I want I really just want to put everything in a tub like the tub right here and just all the clothes dirty clothes just mix them all up mine his and the girls and just take them to the laundromat just have them all washing at once have them all drying at once bring them all home at once and be able to hang and fold as I do other things and he was like, no, just do it at home because it's too much work for you. You're going to be contracting and it's going to not make you feel good. And if you do that, you're only going to be focusing on one thing at a time. Um, so basically, he's like, if I'm home, I can wash clothes throughout doing other stuff. And I'm at home so I can rest. I can be in my PJs. I can, you know, if I'm contracting, I can sit down or, you know, whatever and chill and eat and blah, blah, blah. So usually when he gives me advice like that I regret it like <laughs> y'all always say it I'm like I should have did what I said I was going to do I don't even know why I asked him now I'm you know in this predicament or whatever but um I think this time I'm going to go with what he said um everyone in my family is really worried about the whole um contracting thing that I've been that this pregnancy has started I've been contracting really early in a lot and they're really worried about it. They just don't want me to go into preterm labor. So, I'm here. Um, so, like I said, the, my agenda today was to do my room. Which isn't bad at all, you guys. It's not. Because I've done a majority of it um, 
last week when I cleaned out my closet and I gave away a lot of clothes and, the, and I have, that's why I have to wash a lot of other clothes um I, like I said I just have to like clean off my dresser I'm gonna clean behind my dresser <clears throat> I'm gonna try to see if I can bring all those clothes downstairs to wash that way I'm not going up and down the steps getting loads um you know normal make my bed up things like that um then I'm gonna do the bathroom and then when the girls get home um they clean their room so-called clean their room yesterday <laughs> and um by the end of the day it looked like they didn't do anything so uh, when they get home they're going to clean their room detailed okay like I said not scrubbing no baseboards or anything but they're gonna clean their room like I want their room to look um I'm going to help them out slightly <laughs> and um I'm gonna have my oldest daughter work on their closet um this tub here that I pointed to earlier I don't know if you guys can see because it's really dark but this tub here um I think I was gonna use it for the party as like a big cooler I was gonna put ice and drinks and things in it because um it's just easier that way but I think I may just put this in their closet for their extra toys and stuff because they have a toy chest box thing but um it's kind of it's not small it's a but the space inside is not that big like it's the the toy chest itself is, is a good size it's just it's not a lot of room inside and there's stuff because especially because Jordan's getting older you know she's about to be nine her things aren't as small and they're you know weirdly shaped so <laughs> Um, some of that stuff is like spilling out of it and it just doesn't look good. So I think I'm going to put the access in the tub or put a majority of them in the tub and then put the access in the toy chest since the toy chest is actually in the room. I don't know, but something like that um, just to make it look a little better. And then in between all of that, I have to do laundry and hang in faux clothes. So um, I'm trying to do all of this. It's a lot in two days that I'm doing. Um, it just sounds like, oh, you're just cleaning your house. What are you talking about? But I'm just trying to, I'm not only cleaning my house like I would normally do, but I'm trying to get things in order to set up for this party on Saturday. Um, if you guys don't know by now, I'm, I'm sure you've seen the other clips if you're watching this video. But um, we're having a gender reveal slash cookout this Saturday and so in my house. So I'm just trying to get things in order, get things together in addition of just the normal cleaning. So. That is on my agenda today. I am going to um, go in here and get my phone. I'm going to call my aunt again, see where she is. If she does not answer this time, I'm getting dressed. And I'm going to Jimmy John's to get my sandwich. I'm going to go get her bag on pump. And then I'm going to come home. And if she wants her bag on the pump, she's going to have to come to me to get it. Um, because I'm not going to be going back out because I have other things to do. Okay, so that is the plan. I'm going to take you guys a long so, either way, I'll see you guys in the car. I'll see you back. Hey, y'all. I'm in the car. I already, I didn't go to Walmart. I actually, why do I go to lighting? is terrible. Anyway, so I actually went to Target. And this little shopping center over here, this huge shopping center over here. I just dropped the pump off to my aunt. And I grabbed what I call a snack, not lunch. So, um, I'm thinking about grabbing lunch. But I really need to go to the grocery store for dinner tonight. I just don't know what I want to do. Um, yeah, so I'm on the way home because I have to pick up the girls. It's 3.07. I need to be home before 3.30 to be able to get them off of the bus. I'm not going to be able to make it to pick them up from school. So, yeah, so that's the plan. Like I said, I'm driving right now and um, figure out what I'm going to do. See y'all in a minute. 